started playing soccer right here? Oh, uh, yeah, I started actually playing soccer when I was about four. And um, I, I, was at, I never played in college. I, I uh, committed to Oklahoma when I was still a junior in high school, so I had to stop playing when I was 17. But that's definitely just uh, been a huge impact from taking all the punts to the goal kicks, uh, playing goalie, and uh, I guess, honestly, oh, my kicking background to that. Okay, let's look at soccer a little hair. bit then. USA England, first game in the World Cup. How do you assess that looking at another big game later? <laughs> Well, let me ask you the same question. Where are you from? London, in England. Uh, <laughs> I'm biased. Yeah, no, I know, I know, I know. I, 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 I had a feeling where you're from. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, honestly, it's gonna you know, be a, a good matchup. Uh, I can't. Uh, I'll, I'll definitely be watching. But you know, for this week, I think uh, I have a couple different things I'm gonna focus on and worry about. Derek, can, can we talk a little bit about your hair? Um, what styling products do you use? <laughs> I, um, yes, I'm being absolutely dead serious. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know what it's called. I get it from uh, a salon in New Orleans. What do you feel that your hair says about your style of kicking? I'm a laid back person. Uh, I'm, I'm not too worried about what people's perceptions are of me. Um, I do know, I guess at, at this stage, you know, you have to be professional. I, and I'm, you know, I'm 23, I'm trying to learn to be professional about everything that I do. But at the same time, I'm not gonna let who I am, um, you know, dictate the way I, I change my clothes or I dress and uh, I just um, yeah, am who I am. How long does it take to style it? <laughs> uh, probably about 30, 30 seconds, not long at all. You don't use a flat iron or anything like that? <laughs> Actually, I, I have before. Uh, it's just, uh, you know, uh, <laughs> wow, I can't believe this is uh, what I'm getting asked Super Bowl week. Uh, <laughs> flat iron in the hair. Honestly, just uh, <laughs> you know, I, I do, and uh, I guess everybody worries about their appearance in some ways or what. Um, I, I, I really feel if you uh, believe in yourself and you feel good about yourself, then whatever you do uh, to get it that way. Would it be a good sport? But a really uh, funny question. I, I like it. Bye. Although yes. Remy said he thought you should make it higher. I know, Remy. Yeah, Remy. Remy and I do talk about this. Uh, he, he was telling me to really try to, you know, go out with a complete mohawk today, and it's just kind of—I I don't really even know if you would call mine a mohawk. This is kind of up. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like whatever it is. I know Remy definitely has one. Uh, maybe in the off season. Uh, actually, I just cut my hair. I, maybe whenever it was that long, I could have competed with him. But you know, yeah, I can't even compete, so I'm not gonna worry about spiking it up. You guys had a hair growing contest. You and him? Oh, no, no. He was just uh, about how he has his mohawk, and whenever I had my long hair, if I really wanted to spike it up, I could. But, you know, uh, I'll let him take the cake on this one. He's got me beat. Who's got the best hair on the team, you think? Scott Fujita, by far. Mm -hmm. I mean, it, really? he, he could... Uh, yeah. Kind of got a little bit of a mullet going on, you know, but it's, it's feathered. It, it is. It's yeah. feathered. It's textured. I mean, you know, he's a good-looking guy. I'm sure Swab should use him in a commercial, and I'm sure that would uh, work out really well. Can, can I take you back to two weeks ago?